Game one of the Christmas holiday tournament here at Northampton County High School finished today with the Northwest Halifax Vikings sliding past the Greenville County Eagles. The Greenville County Eagles started off fast, and their leading scorer, Zakeem Fields, led all scores today. But it wasn't enough to stop a second half surge by the Vikings, led by senior Denise Daniels. And then I had the chance to speak with Coach Walden of the Greenville County Eagles and how his team sort of slid off in the second half. Uh, good game, man. Uh, that was a good team we played. Uh, you know, referees kind of took took the game out of our hands. Uh, that, I mean, that's basically it. Referees took the game away from us. But uh, you know, congratulations to them. Uh, pretty good team. Pretty good team. But you know, at the end of the day, can't beat six, seven guys. What can you tell me about uh, Zakeem today offensively, and then uh, Franklin defensively? Um, them guys don't exactly what's expected of them. Uh, Zakeem leading score for us. Know how to score. You know. Know how to get guys in better positions. You know, to score the basketball as well. Uh, Franklin, his energy is through the roof, man. Um, just try to, we got to get him going offensively. People won't even know it, but he's a great scorer. But he, he won't show it. He won't show it. So we got to go back and figure out some ways of how we can get him scoring offensively. Um, but defensive wise, no, you know, he's full of energy, high energy guy, you know. So, you know, uh, overall game, I'm not. Not, not a bad game, not a bad game, but, you know, like I said, referees messed up a, a perfectly good game. Well, what are you hoping to get out of these next two days going back? I'm um, just working on, you know, working on some things we need to work on. We're still not playing together like we should, talking on defense, and this will give us also some games going into the break. Um, you know, we, we haven't been able to practice. Uh, since we've been out, so you know, these these couple games right here will help us out going back into coming off the break, uh, January eighth. So we should be fine, though. We I also had a chance to speak with the winning coach, Coach Rich of the Northwest Palapet Vikings. All right, Coach Rich. First thing, congratulations on the win. Appreciate um, it. Better ball movement in the second half. Would you say that's the biggest contribution to the win tonight? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's what it was. Mostly, first half we had too many turnovers, man. Too many turnovers, and any team that have a lot of turnovers, bro, it's hard to win a game. And then the uh, tenacity, we say that's the biggest part. I saw definitely a big pickup in tenacity in the second half, especially on the defensive end. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. That's how you can win. That's the only way you can win championships. You got to play defense. Uh, strong minutes tonight from Josh Norman and his return. Oh, yeah. How big was his play tonight, and how do you manage him going forward for the next two days? Well, everybody, everybody can see that Josh, will, you know, he's a big part of the team. I mean, guys react to him a little bit better when he, when he playing. So it was good to see Josh come back. I'm glad he's healthy. I'm glad his ankle doing better for him. All right, big minutes tonight from Marjorie as well. So, freshman, not too big for the spotlight? Not the spotlight too big for him? Yeah, I don't think it is. I don't think it is. Long, if it was, I wouldn't have pulled him up. Yeah. And that concludes game one of the Christmas tournament right here at Northampton County High School with the Northwest Vikings sliding by the Greenville County Eagles, 63-57. This is James Taker Williams. You can follow him on Instagram and Twitter at tankwheel underscore. This is Big Sports TV.